Wow. Matt, thanks so much. Well, if you're looking for some great entertainment, Becky Hancock with the Tennessee Theater is here to talk about what the theater has lined up for February. And the very first thing is, you know, we've been covering National Signing Day all throughout our shows this yes. morning, and that continues till tonight at the theater. Yes, uh, Coach Butch Jones will be there, and he's going to go in depth to this class of recruits. And it's a it's a really exciting event. We've done this, I think, a couple of years at the theater. So we love having all the Vol fans come down and get excited about next year's football team. Oh, and I, they are excited oh, this yes. year, as you've seen all morning. <laughs> so that is actually at 6.30 tonight. Right, and it is a University of Tennessee presented event. Mm -hmm. So the theater is not actually selling tickets for that. You have to go to uttix.com to get tickets for that event. Okay, uttix.com. Make sure that you, uh, if you want to go to that, that that's where you go for your tickets. Also this week, I know because my family and I go to the Broadway shows mm -hmm. that Flashdance is in town. Yes. Well, so I think most people think of Flashdance as the hit uh, movie sure. from 1983. What a feeling. I'm not going to sing that for you this morning. <laughs> but uh, it's been made into a touring Broadway show, and we're very excited to have a couple performances this weekend at the Tennessee. Now, those are Friday and Saturday? Correct. We have uh, two on Saturday, a matinee and an evening, and then a Friday evening show. Okay. We have good tickets for all, all three yet. So tickets are still available. Mm -hmm. Our, uh, the Knoxville Opera has a big, and this is a well-known opera that they're presenting. Yes. Even if you think you don't know opera, you do know music from Carmen. Mm -hmm. And um, the Knoxville Opera, we're very proud to have them as one of our um, regular users of the theater. And this will be a wonderful pr production centered around Valentine's Day. So they have a performance on the 13th and the 13th. And then February 16th, um, In the Mood brings back the big band era. Yes, this is a great uh, touring show that focuses on big band music from the 30s and 40s. Um, Gene Krupa was the, a drummer who uh, played, I believe, with Glenn Miller, and, and uh, In the Mood was a, a really popular hit. So this uh, show is based or it's named after that tune. So they're going to have the orchestra, vocalists, swing dancers, a whole great evening um, on the 16th. Yes. Then the 19th through the 20th of the symphony. Yes, um, they're going to be that. The great thing about this performance is it really showcases the renovation of the theater and the larger stage that we have. Mm -hmm. They're uh, performing um, a piece by Dvorak, which is a Czech composer. It's a choral and orchestral piece called Stabat Mater. And so to have all of those musicians and singers on stage at once couldn't have happened before our renovation that was completed 10 years ago. So it's going to be a huge sound, I bet. Yes, yes. And then um, Shen Yun is coming February 24th through 25th. That's been here before, right? It, it has. Um, it was definitely here last year, maybe some years in the past. Um, and it is a review of Chinese culture and arts uh, over the long 5,000 year history of, of Chinese culture. So it's it's a wonderful dance program. It's a great family program. And then finally, the 27th, Casey Musgraves will perform from her Grammy award-winning debut album. Yes, and she's had a really busy le year last year. She was touring with uh, the likes of Alison Krauss and Willie Nelson, and we're very excited to have her at the Tennessee. That'll be a really great show. All right, Becky, thanks so much. And we're coming right back after this.